So A Loving Colour came out last year. Uh, it was already a bestseller on the Sunday Times list. So congratulations. Thank you. Um, and it's a collection where you have rewritten some ancient myths and legends. Mm -hmm. um, can you tell us about maybe, first of all, specific, specifically about this one and um, where it comes from and, and what inspired you? Well, I mean, Oshun, I'm Yoruba, I'm Nigerian, I'm, uh, and my ethnic group within Nigeria is Yoruba. And, um, you know, when I first decided to do this book, I was very scared because I was taking these revered myths and legends and it's part of history and reworking them and making my own whilst also trying to pay homage to them. So I thought, okay, let me start my own culture because if I mess that up too badly, the guilt won't be as bad as it is for other cultures. Um, so I started with Oshun and just like almost a test to myself if I could do this. And um, when I started writing it, I fell in love with the process of, um, first of all, doing the research and delving into my own culture and discovering things that I didn't know before, but also discovering how I see love and creating this character and, and building this world around her. Um, and when I finished the story, I was like, okay, maybe I can do this. And I sent it to my editor and she's like, yeah, I knew you could do this. That's why, that's why we're doing this. Um, but for me, it was a test, definitely. And I wanted it to be the first story in the book because it was the first story that I wrote. And it means so much to me that I was able to like actually do it. 